Hey, Anthony, good afternoon to you, man. This is Adam over here at Perkins Motorplex. Want to get you a good look at our vehicle that you found. This is the 2023 Jeep Grand Cherokee Overland four-wheel drive. Really, really nice. I just got back from driving it. I put about 10 miles on it. Uh, drove smooth. AC works great. Uh, really, really nice car. I've walked around it a couple times. I'll, I'll do my best to point out literally everything that I've seen. Uh, if anything new pops up as I'm walking around at this time, I will definitely point that out. But I think the condition and stuff is going to be exactly what you're looking for. And then obviously we think that all the options that you're curious about, it does have too. So diving in, man, um, again, we don't work off commission. Warranty on this one, you'll get all that factory coverage as well as the 30-day warranty. That's complimentary. Also, though, we will have the option to add the warranty protection on this one. It's actually, I checked on it before I walked out. It's six years. 120,000 total miles so another 100,000 for your bumper to bumper and your powertrain items anything minus emissions and then like wear and tear brakes tires uh wipers filters that kind of stuff so no deductible nationwide coverage anywhere you want to take it i have it on everything that i ever buy and it's a lot cheaper when it's on the new year model low miles so tires on this one really good shape those will look almost new uh bridgestones matching set all the way around Coming up front, I like to try to use some body angles, see if anything kind of sticks out, like those shopping cart marks and stuff like that that happens over time with every vehicle. If you ever go to Walmart, uh, not noticing any of those spots on this driver's side. Starting again from the rear, just doing the same thing. Yeah, happy to say I'm still not seeing any, so that's great. Coming across the rear of the vehicle, does have your proximity sensors going left to right there does have the hitch cover as well for the tow package the hitch and everything's covered up does have both key fobs again on the phone i told you about that it is kind of a rarity for us but you've got your remote start i'm gonna go ahead and use that right now get that ac that i talked about there we go sorry uh get that ac that i was talking so highly of go ahead and get that part going for us also on the key fob you do have your hatch release button but if i can get this thing to go i know it has it i may just be doing it wrong to be honest with you this car is a lot nicer than anything i've got i may have it turned off too inside so i'll double check that in just a second but inside uh or i'm sorry down the passenger side here looks really good Again, happy to say it matches the driver. Not noticing any of those kinds of marks at all. Mirror caps and everything look really, really good. Right there on just the chrome seal, it looks like maybe a rub. If I had to guess, you don't even really feel it. it may even be like a protective film, but that's the only thing I really notice on the whole exterior. Coming across the front, it's got, again, the proximity sensors across the lower part of the bumper. The chrome's really popping. It's got one touch-up spot right there, and then a small one over here. Again, very minor, not really easy to notice at all or anything, but if I see it, I point it out just to be transparent. Hopping inside. Again, I was telling you, the sunshades for the second row it's like a must have for my wife and I on our road trips with our kids. It's got the really nice color for the interior. I love that. Back space over here. It's got the mat, which is a nice sign that somebody took pride in the vehicle. I love it when they have extra add-ons. It's very clean. Our detailing staff does an amazing job. They're probably the best of any of us lots of charging ports down low it's got the rear heated seats there rear ac controls pull that down there we go and then now that i've got it unlocked i may just not be smart enough to know how to do it to be honest with you let me hop in here it does have the power seats and this is all the electronics that are protected with the warranty too. So like memory seats, the massager, the power windows, mirror controls, door locks, power options, all, again, no deductible, 
parts and labor up to 120,000 miles. This one does have the upgraded audio. So that is the Macintosh system there. See that on both sides of the top of the dash. Windshield looks good. No smells, no odors, not seeing like burn marks or anything like that on the sides. Seats look great. I mean, it's really about as new as anything we can get. Just the buyer's guide down there. It's got the height adjustment too, so you can actually control the suspension uh, from inside, which is really nice. Got your different drive modes over here. On the center stack, first and foremost, it's got the ventilated seats, it's got the heated seats, it's got all of your defrost and AC controls down lower. You got your screen off button, which is kind of nice. Like valet modes, what most brands call that. In here, you've got all of your vehicle control options. So you've got your mirror. That's another thing I wanted to point out. So on this one, that's the digital view. And then obviously you've got the standard as well right there. And you got your brightness settings, zoom settings, all that stuff right there as well. You got your lane keep assist or lane departure warning, park aid sensors. It's got the rear camera, everything right there as well. On the other settings, you've got different themes that are available. I always keep mine on the dark. It's just less strain on my eyes, it feels like. Um, all of your driver feedback and things like that are there as well. Then you can go in and even turn on and off active driver's assist, lane departure. Again, any of those things, you have complete and total control, which is really, really nice. Um, got the vibration in the seats, got blind spot alert. I mean, really about everything possible. It's got it. On the home screen, you've got your phone pairing, of course, you've got your audio, you've also got all of your AC controls right here as well through the dash. Got your nav screen, phone options, vehicle options is where I just was. And then it's got several apps available. So right now, obviously Bluetooth, things like that, AM, FM, USB. You've also got all of your comfort settings, nav, phone, really nice vehicle so that's all the different pages that you can actually change or upload oops sorry you got the system settings it's really nice I think you're gonna like it again it's got everything it's showing that it has everything I'm gonna figure out how to work that hatch side of it but otherwise everything looks really really good I'll end it just showing full function here on the sunroof, showing how that part there is fully functional. And thankfully today, we've got a blue sky right there as well to kind of highlight it. It's always better than when it's on a rainy day. So all right, I'll go ahead and get this over to you. Just let me know what you think, man. I'm ready.